Welcome back, viewers. This episode, we're gonna do another fucking Daedric side quest! <laughs> Woo! Okay, so, something real quick of note, viewers. In the most recent patch of Skyrim, they have taken... They, they, they made it impossible to do the Agma Infinium glitch. Now, you can no longer use the glitch to get yourself a set of skills, put it into a bookshelf, take it, then do it all over again. It no longer works. You can still hold on to the Agma Infinium, but you will no longer be able to get skills after that first set. Also, as you can probably see, I gained two levels. Ugh, excuse me. I actually have two save files. Let me come into here real quick. Because I got this one, which is my level 81 Khajiit. I did the Ogma Infinium glitch in order to get it all the fucking way up to 81. And then I've got the one that I'm currently playing on. Now, Something else of note, viewer, something I was waiting to explain to y'all. On any skill that you see as, let's see, at 100, you can hit Y and turn it to Legendary. Now, what Legendary does is reset the skill to 15, give you all the perks that you had on it back, and you can grind it all the way back up to 100. So in theory, you can get infinite fucking levels. I am not going to do this. All legendary things, I'm just going to do off screen. For now, let's go do this way. Okay, good. I got my Dragon Bone Dagger on. Success. Oh, balls. Holy sh... Oh. Oh, okay. I get it. I get it. Apparently, I forgot to take off that set of armor, which was fine clothes. Oops. <laughs> I get it. <coughs> okay. So that was a fuck up. <laughs> Crouch down. Let's see. No, 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 no. Actually, yes, real quick. Shouts. I picked up Slow Time Sand earlier while I was exploring some of those ruins. I don't remember which one I got it off of, just know I just found it at random. There we go. Magical Gills! Oh. Add these on by accident. These are useless. Get out of my inventory. And you, I should actually have... Yeah, I actually have to hold on to because it's a quest item. Indeed. Batman. How you doing, Shadowmere? I don't know why. I know it's called Shadowmere, but I always call it Shadowmere. As in Shad... Uh. Not Shad Doe. I don't know. Oh, let's do that. Oh, where? Fuck you, Dongard. Fuck you. See if I can get over here without being slaughtered. I love you, Dodge Roll. Look at my temple lying in ruins. So much for the constancy of mortals. Their crafts and their hearts. If they love me not, how can my love reach them? Now then, the quest item that you need to have to get this, let's come on down here into Misk, is the, here we go, this one, the beacon. You will find this at complete random, I think, in a treasure chest. It'll just randomly spawn in a treasure chest. I've always gotten it in the first mission you do for the companion. It has always been in the treasure chest of the uh, bandit chief. Restore to me my beacon, and 
I might guide you toward your death. There you go. Whoa, 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 whoa! Hey! Put me down! No! Where the fuck am I? Can't see shit. Oh, this isn't good. There! There! Stay back! No! I can't pull out my dagger! Ah, leave me alone! I do not exist! Okay, enough fucking about. You're quite a sexy ball of lights, aren't you? I'll do it! Of course you will. I have commanded it. Well, aren't you a conceited bitch? The artifact must be reclaimed and Malcarin destroyed. Malcarin has forced the door shut. A thick is my temple and it Please tell me you're just gonna teleport me back down there. Please. I will send down Pretty a please. ray of light. Pretty please with human souls on top. I've got plenty of soul gems that have souls in them. Oh no. You fucking bitch! Just kidding, viewers. <laughs> okay. First things first, let's go on and get this fucking mission selected. This way! Says the map. Now, for those who are curious as to which Daedric artifact I'm going to go for next, it's a toss up between Shea Gorath's Wabajack, Mac Zombie fucking up my recording set, or Mac Zombie fucking up my recording set again. Yes, that totally works. Or, uh, one of the other ones I have. I forget what it's called right now. Sanguine's Rose. I think. I'm not sure. Maybe I'm talking about- God damn you, Snipe Caboose! I will destroy you! Shit. Let's see which way it is. This way? Yes. About here. No. About here. Success. You know, I could probably. I could probably unload all these picks because now I only need one. Useless. My Dragon Bone Dagger is much better. Well, this guy certainly seems to be dead. So I hope he is, considering I'm dealing with a goddamn necromancer. Oh god, I remember this place. I remember. Yay. Activate. And now we can continue. This. Uh, th this Daedric artifact revolves around light puzzles. And that's why I was saying, oh god, I remember this place. Because the light puzzles in this game, or in this, isn't all that... ...clever. Balls. I mean, it literally equates to just find where the light hmm, where the light is shining to and activate the thing see activate the thing 
now we can move on. No balls. Now, something real quick of note about legendary things. It does, contrary to what people believe, having a thing go into legendary does not give you any bonus stats for that thing. Like, say, if I took sneak up to legendary, it won't give me a bonus to sneaking. It'll just turn it to legendary stat, and as far as I know, for legendary, you can, in fact, do it multiple times, as many times as you damn well please. If I'm wrong on this, then hey, somebody will correct me. If I'm right, then hey, nobody will correct me. And now you're dead. That soul gem. I like soul gems. It appears to be a dead end. Oh. Ah, just There we go. Come on. <sighs> nope, get in there. Damn. Okay, I'm gonna have to do this the way they want you to. Man. Always gotta ruin my fun, funky aftermath. How the fuck am I supposed to do this? I have honestly forgotten. It's been so long since I've done these Daedric Artifact side quests. Okay. If that's the way it's gonna be, I'm gonna go this way. Funny how these things have a walking animation even though they're floating. Now, I do have Oblivion. Some of y'all are probably wondering why I'm not doing that first. Well, it's because I personally actually like Oblivion more than Skyrim. Personally. I will, of course, do Oblivion, but it's like the old saying goes, you save the best for last. And if that isn't acceptable enough for you guys, then fuck you. Whoops. Not exist. Hey, the door's open. Bye bye. Fuck you, bro. I'm out of here. Okay, let's continue this. Oh yeah. Where the fuck am I? I think the lights are trying to lead me somewhere. I don't know. Maybe I'm just insane. Maybe I should have gone with Shayagor at first. Maybe. Just maybe. You guys need to stop asking so many questions. You ever think about that? Huh? Huh? No. Of course you didn't. God, why am I the only one who thinks of good stuff on those random-to-random -random basis? 
feel like I'm the only one trying in this relationship, viewers. You make me sick. Potion! Now, now we gotta get over there. Which I do believe in order to get over there, you need to go through here. Indeed. Sucka. Now, I could search through all of these urns, and it'll yield maybe a little bit of monies, but I've already got so much monies, it don't really even matter. After this episode, viewers, I will be going to the throat of the world. Or at least up to where I need to be going for the main quest. Bye bye. Remember, viewers, exploration never hurts. I guess he couldn't get a leg up. Oh, bad joke. I need to out me way. Alas, poor York. You are very ugly. Aha! Knock, 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 knock. Free skull! So used to picking stuff up in Oblivion, I've forgotten how to pick things up in here. Crouch. And now we can move on. Da 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 da. I need to download Zelda sound effects, and every time I do something random, overlay them. Like, created a Dragonbone dagger. Da 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 da. Open a door. You know, that kind of stuff. I will be the bane of your existence. Oh, oh my. Else, yes. Well, that was probably not smart, but oh damn well, I survived. So I'm pretty sure I did. Could be wrong, but I'm pretty sure I did. <gasps> hey, buddy! Aww. My buddy had to go. I'm sad now. All work and no play makes Rage a boring Let's Player. Meow. <laughs> And just like that, I can get zapped by the light. Oh. Yeah, I should probably stop doing that. Come on. Yes. Yush. Oh, bollocks. Stop looking at me! You are not the Eye of Sauron! I did not actually like that movie. That series things. Fuck you guys, I'm out of here. Ah. I did not like the Lord of the Rings. Personally, it dragged on way too fucking long for an unrewarding payout. And I know what y'all are gonna say, or maybe I don't. I don't know. I'm not a mind reader. All I do know is no, it's not about the fucking journey. If this one ring was supposed to be so dangerous and threatened to bring down the, all, all the people, why didn't they just take those flying griffins there in the first place? You know, cut out several years of trekking, practically. I don't know. Maybe I'm the crazy one here. Maybe my undeniable logic is too much for my fragile psyche to bear. 
maybe, just maybe, Warhammer was a terrible game. By the way, he has lots of minions. And I have a way I'm gonna finish this. Come on, close the doors real quick. I need my cloak of nocturnal. There we go. Or not. God damn you! Bang! Ah. It's one thing I hate about the Cloak of Nocturnal. Sometimes I'm just unable to activate it. If you kill the Necromancer, all of the other guys will die. So all you have to do is just kill this Necromancer. And then that thing appears. I forgot about that thing. What is that thing? Oh, well, whatever it is, it's dead now. And it these guys it. should have died. I missed. I missed again. There. Problem solved. Stop bothering. Let's see if I have any. I think I've already got Magilite. Or Mage Light. Or Magnify. And just like that, viewers, we have completed our quest. The Necromancer has been dealt with. And we have gained favor of one of the female Daedras. Maybe. I'm not sure. She always seems to be a bitch. That's why I like Nocturnal more. Oh, crap. No. You're going to drop me to my death again, aren't you? All right, let's do this. I will wield this mighty blade in thy name. May the light of certitude guide your efforts. And then we fall to our death again. Alright, viewers, so we have completed the mission for this little lady. And for doing so, we have gotten the Dawnbreaker. The Dawnbreaker is a obviously a Daedric artifact. It does... Uh, well, you can read it. it. It's useful against undead. I don't use it, though, for obvious reasons. Now then. Next time, we will be going to talk to the Greybeards. And just as a quick proof of concept before I end this off, head on back over here to White Run.
Come on. Oh, there we go. I will soon enough be moving to Solitude, but I need to do Solitude's Jarl's quest first. And personally, I do like Solitude's house more, but that's just me. But as a quick point of reference and proof of concept, as you can see, I am no longer able to do anything with the Ogma Infinium. Mama, you're home. How you doing, Lucia? I got you a present, Mama. I hope you like it. Ah, oh, thank you. So, viewers, go on and drop my useless Daedric artifact off in here with the Staff of Magus and the Ariel's Bow. And we'll go on and see y'all next time. It said drop it off, not equip it. See you, viewers.